I came to the conference basically uh, to speak about cash transfers and social service and what are the best practices on the links between cash transfers and social service. So basically my talk here was uh, inspired by the experiences in Latin America where conditional cash transfer programs have spread throughout the two year 2000 until now. We have 30 programs in the region and many of these programs have used two characteristics of these programs. The fact that they are child focused and the fact that they have developed large scale monitoring information systems which enabled the programs to identify families and beneficiaries of these programs that were not having access to basic social services. And then to design or to make sure that the line ministries, like the Ministry of Education and Health, did provide the service that they were supposed to provide to this population that's already poor and excluded. In many cases, it's not enough to have the cash if you don't have access to the social service and you cannot do one thing or the other. For the family actually to develop and for child to be protected, they need to have both. So the major benefit of developing this infrastructure is actually to make sure that the family is going to develop to the, to the maximum potential uh, of the child.